other day I was talking to a group and I was sharing with them all the benefits of LinkedIn because LinkedIn is a great way to share yourself professionally. And I started talking about you need to get some LinkedIn recommendations and they were nervous. <sighs> they said like, how do we get a recommendation? Like, do we ask people for them? Oh my God, Karen, you can't just ask people. They were kind of shy. And I said, you know, I'm Italian. And my dad always taught me the art of reciprocity. You do a favor for somebody and they'll do a favor back for you. You know what I mean? But what it means is if I write a recommendation for you, maybe it's going to tap you on the shoulder and say, hey, hey. I'm going to write one for Karen. So think of when you're thinking about LinkedIn and the recommendations, that art of reciprocity. So the next thing I want to talk about today is, well, how do you write a good LinkedIn recommendation? Like, do I just say they were great and you'll be done with it? So I'm going to give you five steps. And if you follow these five steps in order, you too can become a pro at writing a LinkedIn recommendation. Are you ready? Okay, step number one. Say something great about the person. If you can't say something nice, don't say nothing at all. Say something that when the reader sees it, they want to read more. I'm going to give you an example as we go through of a meeting planner that I met. Her name is Emily. Well, how are you doing? So it might go something like this. Meeting Emily was a defining moment in my speaking career. That was step number one. Step number two, define the relationship. Tell us how you know the person. So we're talking about this person. We need to know well, what's the connection here. Emily hired me to be the opening speaker at her association's national meeting in Las Vegas, Nevada. So now you know how I met Emily and what the relationship was. Oh. Step number three share how their contribution helped you. So for me, from the moment I met Emily, I knew I was working with a professional. She shared with me the vision of the conference and she shared the mission and what she was trying to accomplish. Step number four, share how the person that you're giving the recommendation for maybe grew their team or grew their relationship with the customer or grew their organization. So an example for me would be watching Emily work with her multi-generational team was eye-opening to me. I saw how she managed people and she shared her vision with them. Bonjour. Step number five, end your recommendation with a personal note. End it with something positive. So for me, working with Emily was a great experience and I look forward to working with her again. Make it short and sweet. So those are the five steps in how to write a really killer LinkedIn yeah. recommendation. I hope that helped. Bye-bye. This is Karen McCullough with another Lesson from the Road.